All right, so today, 98 Thrill 1 VFR 800 Honda Interceptor. Uh, this is a 98 model, but Thrill 1, they're all the same. The reason why I wanted to take a moment to shoot this is this has a combined or a linked brake system, completely hydraulic front and rear, dual calipers in the front. But what's different is that the rear is not independent from the front, uh, they're linked or combined, and it's not ABS. So something in between the two, I guess that's where technology went at the turn of the millennium. But uh, there's multiple bleed points and you have to do it in the right order, otherwise you're just gonna be wasting your time. And fortunately, um, somebody uh, took the time to post a manual for this specific model, 98 drill on VFR 800 um, online, the service manual, so just the owner's manual. So you start at the front and you fill the master, you clean it up, you fill the master, and then you go, to the right outer um, bleed nipple, which is the one that is closer to the fork. You get that going, and then you just switch to the left side, and you do the left outer. Do not go to the center. The center is actually drawn from the rear master. So after you do that, you close this off, you have the front done, and then you come back here. This is kind of deceiving. The rear master cylinder is located right here, and then here's the proportioning valve, which we'll get to in a second but you can fill the rear master without taking this panel off. So you open the cap, you fill, and then you transition back to the front of the bike. Again, this is kind of deceiving um, against what we would normally think for bleeding rear brakes, but you transition to right center, which again, it's not the one closest to the fork, it's the one between uh, the two banjo bolts. So right center, left center, you bleed those while you fill up brake fluid through the master in the rear. And then you transition to the proportioning valve, which is why the tank is up right now. You have to lift the tank from the rear and prop it up to access the proportioning valve. And then you have two bleed valves on the rear brake caliper. So front, one, two, rear, fill the fluid, one, two, three, and then you have two at the rear. Uh, the one that is more difficult to access in the center and further back, you do first, and then finally you close with the easier one to access, and you can reference the service manual and the picture diagrams that I'll put up in the video. Thanks for tuning in.